How are you doing? This is Dr. Juwan. If you haven't done so already, four things. Hit the subscribe button. Next to that, the like button. Over there is the bell notification. And please leave a comment or a question. Yes, I do answer the, co the questions as general as I can. However, if they get too detailed, this is where I'm directing you over to my webpage. I'll be more than happy to schedule an appointment with you and we could talk Zoom. We could Zoom, we could talk on the phone, or if you're in the area, please stop in and make an appointment because I'll be more than happy to answer the questions more in detail. Hey, what's going on, man? How you doing? Hey, what's going on? No, I want to talk about a supplement that one of our viewers wrote in about to talk about something called berberine, which is very compatible to metformin and treating type 2 diabetes. So what's the benefits of the supplement? Oh, the benefits are amazing. It contains antiviral properties. It supports healthy blood sugar levels. It contains antimicrobial properties. It's good for the GI system. It's good for your gut. It helps with blood pressure, cholesterol, liver enzymes. This product, I'm telling you, is amazing. So a lot of viewers ask, what brand and the dosage? Oh, brands? <laughs> Come on now, you know we don't promote brands. And remember, we always recommend do your own research. Why? Because your health is your decision. And the brands, there's many different brands and believe it or not, sometimes your system may be sensitive to certain brands. So this is why we don't promote a single brand. Exactly. Yeah, check out the webpage, book him for an appointment. He's kind of smart. Hope you enjoy the video. Take care. So enjoy the video. Thank you for watching. Hello everyone, this is Dr. Juwan, and thank you to the viewer who wrote in and recommended I do a video on berberine. With brands, this is the best I could do. Upon doing the research on berberine, I found out it's a phenomenal supplement and it's been around for thousands of years. It's a natural plant alkaloid used to treat diarrhea and gastrointestinal issues for a long time. In addition, with doing the research, now again, I always recommend do your own research, okay, because your health is your importance. I found out that it is just as effective, if not better, than metformin to help stabilize blood sugar. And the research has pro proven that the reason why it's better is because metformin does have a lot of side effects. So definitely this would be good to help stabilize blood sugar, but also in addition, it helps diabetes, blood pressure, it helps boost the mood, cholesterol, autoimmune diseases, it helps lower and stabilize liver enzymes, helps with weight control. It's a natural antibiotic. So berberine is a phenomenal supplement to use to boost your overall health. Now the question is how? How does this supplement benefit your body so dramatically? We have an enzyme, it's called the adenosine monophosphate activated protein kinase. <laughs> Try saying that about 10 times fast. AMPK, otherwise known as AMPK. Now what it is, it's the master switch in each of our cells. All of our cells, we have an on button and we have an off button. So when it comes to all of our cells, AMPK, is the master switch because it directly influences cells in the brain with the brain energy, the function, the repair, and overall maintenance. So it does help boost overall mood. So if you have this master switch that boosts cellular energy, it can help stabilize the blood glucose levels, insulin sensitivity, it helps lower our triglycerides, which will turn increase our fat burning process. Okay, so what is AMPK? <clears throat> AMPK, adenosine monophosphate activated protein kinase. I just like saying that. It's a central regulator of energy homeostasis. It's the on and off switch for energy, for cellular energy, which helps correlate the metabolic pathways and balances nutrient supply and demand. So it's a phenomenal uh, enzyme that turns on and off cells, especially for the metabolic demand. So the question is how, what happens? How come it doesn't work? How come it, get, it gets dysregulated? Very simple, bad foods. The, st the standard American diet, horrible. It's loaded with artificial sweeteners, GMO, GMO ingredients. So yeah, we are going, we're taking in natural foods now that is horrible for us. Our lifestyle. 
So in turn, we increase our glucose, we increase our fat, which lowers the function of the AMPK. Our cells don't have that, uh, that natural on switch that it should have due to our diet and lifestyle. So what happens? You gain weight, you get diabetes, you get chronic inflammation, neurogenerative diseases, just to name a few. So what happens is that you have an accumulation of cellular waste and damaged proteins. So this is where you get the neurodegenerative diseases and so forth. So AMPK is involved with every single cell function. It helps with glucose regulation, it helps with the lipid and protein metabolism, it's an anti-inflammatory, just to name a few. So what conditions by taking berberine will benefit you? Okay, let's talk about some conditions and dosages that berberine could be a benefit. Now there's many conditions that it's going to help. That's why I always recommend do your own research. Remember, your health is your decision. I'm just kind of like doing a cliff note version, so please do your own research. These are just a handful of conditions because remember what it stimulates, the AMPK. That AMPK is the on and off cellular switch. It's the regulator for, regulator for homeostasis, which our body wants to be in a homeostatic state. So some of these conditions for brain health, for example, it's what, remember, berberine will help normalize blood sugar and brain cell metabolism. Our brain runs on glycogen, which is our basic sugar. And what happens if you have a hypoglycemic state, your brain's not gonna work too well, you're gonna have poor memory, brain fog, cognitive decline, things like that. So it's going to improve your learning, your, your memory, your cognition, because those are all linked to glucose levels. In addition, increased neuroplasticity. What's neuroplasticity? Neuroplasticity is cells that fire together, wire together. This is a process of learning. This is why repetition, repetition is so key, because the more you repeat, the increase, that's called neuroplasticity. So it increases the function of neuroplasticity and learning which is involved with long-term potentiation, which basically the cells, as long as they keep on firing, repetition, 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 you're going to learn better and faster. So increased dopamine and serotonin levels, those feel-good neurotransmitters. I have a couple clients, a couple patients that are, I want to boost my dopamine, I want to boost my, boost my serotonin, epinephrine. Well, berberine could help. Why? Because the lower that AMPK due to diet and lifestyle choices lowers cognition, increases brain fog, you have poor memory. The cardiovascular system, this is the blood system, the heart and blood system. What well, the main thing a berberine does, it lowers what's called intracellular calcium. Intracellular calcium, that is like your get up and go. That is like the ignition switch. And sometimes when we have too much, this is where we get arrhythmias. So it's also used as a powerful antioxidant, anti-inflammatory. It's a great anticoagulant, which is phenomenal for heart health, which will increase your heart performance. In addition, metabolic disorders, metabolic disorders. What, remember, what it does, it helps improve glucose metabolism. So you're gonna increase those, I'm sorry, you're gonna improve the blood lipids, those triglycerides. Triglycerides is blood fat which in turn, it's gonna help you reduce body weight. Leaky gut, a lot of people have leaky gut. Non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, leaky gut. Why? Because we have junctions in our intestines called tight junctions. Now what happens when we have a poor diet, gluten, okay, wheat, that severs those junctions. And this is where you get leaky gut. This is where you get gut inflammation. So with berberine, it improves the tight junctions, which will improve gut motility. In addition, it has a micro, uh, microbial balancing. What it does, it helps kill off our bad bacteria in our gut. SIBO, small intestinal bacterial overgrowth. Leaky gut, you have, a gut, you have too much bad bacteria, and this will help kill it off, which will improve the gut metabolism. Diabetes, remember, you always want a glucose metabolism. So if you're a diabetic, pre-diabetic, or insulin sensitive, this is going to help stabilize the blood sugar, reduce the blood sugar, which increases what's called glycolysis. Glycolysis is utilizing that sugar for energy, which will enhance insulin sensitivity. Okay, so let's talk about dosage. Dosage is always an important question. And remember, dosage is individual to the person. That's why I always recommend 
do your research. Now, it comes to dosage, you want to start off slow. Yes, you want to take them from 15, I'm sorry, 500 milligrams to 1,500 milligrams per day, but you want to divide those dosages. So, so if you have a 500 milligram capsule, do 555, five, five. and it's okay if you go a little bit over, okay? Nobody's measuring off with a fine tooth comb. So you want to divide a small dosage, start with 500 milligrams, and you want to do it three, about 30 minutes before meals because it does help with the blood sugar levels. Now, side effects. Remember, because berberine is a natural antibiotic, it naturally will, will kill off that bad bacteria in your gut, so you may experience some mild diarrhea, that's okay. Diabetes, cardiovascular diabetes, remember, it lowers your blood sugar. So this may lower your blood sugar even more if you go too fast of a dose. Cardiovascular, same thing. Cardiovascular, it's, it's geared to lower the, and stabilize the blood pressure. So remember, take it very slowly. So I hope this helps. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. If you want to get a hold of me, follow my website and hit the schedule button. Yes, I'd be more than happy to talk to you. If you want a consultation for about 20 minutes, see if I could help you or not, that'd be great. And I'll see you in the next video, and please leave a comment, subscribe, and like. Take care.